in the realm of the spirit, I see the battle of internet. When I say battle of internet, I see where hacking became an attack to governments, to institutions, and to people and other things like that. When I say hacking, I'm talking about banks that are known. I'm talking about government and they hack them. American Airlines lifting its ground stop just moments ago as widespread communication outages are, are continuing to impact major airlines, hospitals and banks across the world. And more than 100 911 call centers in the U.S. are currently down. David Spunt joins us live from Washington with the latest. David. Well, good morning. That's good news. So American has lifted its ground stop. That was affecting uh, millions of passengers really across the world. All of the American flights and other flights that are in the air that are controlled by the FAA are allowed to continue to fly to their destination. The others are just ground stopped. But this outage is affecting millions of people from Sydney, Australia, to Boston, Massachusetts, to London, England. Rare to see such a global outage like this persisting for several hours. We have calls to the FBI to see what's being done here. But as we can tell, this is strictly software related, and it appears things are improving at some airports. This is related to a communication system that runs check-ins at airports, keeps flights on time, and banks running. It appears to be down. It's related to the company CrowdStrike. Now, this is a live map from the FAA showing completely closed airports, not ground stops, because the whole page would pretty much be filled up. But the closed airports include Boston's Logan's Air, Boston's Logan Airport, LaGuardia Airport, Milwaukee, also Las Vegas. Vegas. CrowdStrike is affecting Microsoft servers, which is affecting the functionality of apps and websites that we all use to check in at airports. Uh, the current FAA map, the uh, red circles with the uh, white X's show that they are closed. Now, Harry Reid Airport in Las Vegas is one of the airports that is completely closed. Obviously, the goal to get things up and running as soon as possible, but that's up to the FAA, who's monitoring this, who's allowing those flights in the air to continue, but no new flights taking off unless they're American, because that ground stop was just lifted. Now, that third-party software outage is impacting other systems uh, out wide. I want to read this statement from United Airlines. It says that this software outage is impacting computer systems, including at United. While we work to restore those systems, we're holding all aircraft at their departure airports. Flights already airborne are continuing to their destinations. Delta in Atlanta has a similar problem. And guys, you have to remember, Atlanta is a huge hub, especially uh, during the summer in July. Early Earlier, about 110 911 centers uh, were out reporting outages across the country. That's down now into the high 50s, so improving there. But it will not be your passion. I said it will not be your passion. And they see elections, elections that is coming, further election coming, they want to say let the election be on, on uh, electronic voting. That will be very disastrous. It will be very disastrous because he who pays the highest money, he who beats high, will be given the, 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 the mark and the pass. Because they will use it and it will be used to pass people because softwares are going to be invoked in such a way that softwares can go and dictate even your village where you come from and bring out your BVN or whatever, or your name, or your national identification number, or whatever number that you don't share with anybody. Softwares and apps will be doing that. And that is why the 5G, they must bring it out. It's must to come out. No matter how you cry or what you do, 5G, they will project it out and it will come out. And when it comes out, you see the 5G now, take over and 5G everywhere. And that is when these things I'm saying about will now become in vogue. But God will protect us and give us victory in Jesus' name. At the same time, people will no longer need to travel abroad for one thing or the other. You will stay in Nigeria here and then people in abroad will be working on your body. You can be operated in abroad. You are here in Nigeria and they are operating you. These are the kind of softwares I see that is quickly coming out. The knowledge will increase, but the love shall wash cold. That is the scripture. And that scripture is what is fulfilling now. This 2021 is quite a different year. It's quite a different year. A new, a new dawn and a new chapter is opening all together. 
And the chapter that is opening, children of God must stand on the positivity. God should bless us. But whatever negative thing that the year carry, it's not going to be our portion. It's not going to be our portion. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. If Nigerian government needs help, they can get help. But in the realm of the spirit, I am seeing the person you want to help telling you, leave me, I don't need help. Praise God. Somebody you want to help and pull out, you say, leave me, I don't need help. Leave it, I know, leave it. Praise the Lord. Leave it, I what? I know, leave it, I know. Because if they want help, so many things will happen. I see a kind of softwares and a kind of technology that can tell where anybody is and dictate anybody and see anybody at any time. That can come in and help the government to do what needs to be done for security to prevail. But they will not need it. They will say, no, I don't need it. Praise God. So you want to help somebody and you say, no, I don't need it. What is the meaning? So something is wrong. So we pray God to step in and help his people in Jesus' name. We will pray there will not be war, but protests, <laughs> protests of this year, protests of this year is second to none. Last year was a play. Protests of this year is second to none. To extend that the people in government begin to run. Praise God. But the best thing now is for everybody to sit down together, discuss a way forward. Eh? If they discuss a way forward and it's well discussed, everybody wants to be together. Eh? But when a way forward is not discussed, protests increase. Increase and increase and increase. But it is for your good. I say it is for your good. It is for your good. Let not your heart be troubled. It is for your own good. All things working together for your own good. Pray for Ghana. Last night, the Lord revealed to me, I see in the realm of the spirit that they should pray against earthquake and also pray against what is called fights in Ghana. Fights in Ghana. When I say fight, group, fighting group, people, fighting people, pray against that in Ghana. Not so pray South Africa that they should be careful because I see South Africa going to xenophobia again. What is called xenophobia? Strangers should leave their country. They come in again this year. May the Lord deliver them and save them in Jesus' name. You will make money without struggling. God said it will bless you without struggling. You don't need to struggle. God will bless you. In the name of Jesus Christ. I say in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I see in the realm of the spirit, the children of nobody becoming somebody. Uh, the children of nobody, people they say, oh, who is your father? Where are you from? Where do, how do you come about? I see them becoming somebody. Because people will build a house without struggling. You will build a new house. Hey, I see over 30 people in this church building a new house. This year is year for you to build a house. Build your house. People watching all over the world, build your house. It is your time to build your house and nothing will stop you from building. 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 You from building. Build your house. Build your house. Build your house. Build your house. Nothing will stop you from building your house. I see you building your house. I see your business being built. In the name of Jesus Christ. I see you building a house. You will build that house. You will build that house. And you will build that house. In the name of Jesus Christ. Because this year I see people in another level. That money is no more your problem. Money will not be your problem. Fulfillment of your desire is granted to you. 
in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I see the Lord shaking the four corners of the earth. Shaking the four corners of the earth. Just to bless you and to favor you. To lift you up and to make you happy. To take you to where you belong. And to cause your light to shine. Your light is shining. Even in darkness, your light is shining. Your light will shine and shine and shine and shine. And nothing will stop it in Jesus' name. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Now, listen to me, people that are hoping and believing. I don't know who will help me. How do I do this? How do I do that? Don't worry about it. God will help you do it. I say, God will help you do it. 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 In the name of Jesus. Because the heaven is open already. Amen? Heaven is open already to fight our battle. The spiritual battle, the physical battle, God is fighting them for you. And I'm seeing where other countries of the world begin to look for who will help them and come and help them. So people that want to travel, just think twice because instead of traveling, everything will be available here. Eh? Everything will be what? Available for you. And if everything is available for you, you will lack nothing. I say you will lack nothing. You will lack nothing. You will lack nothing. The Lord will be your protection. Psalm 91, he that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. You shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. You and your household shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. You will abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Oh my God. The, 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 the evil politicians, they would have loved to be the president come 2023 but that 2023 is under probability because there is a trap that trap if they survive it <laughs> that's when they can now talk about it the trap is too too tough it's too tough but god will help his people in the name of jesus christ god will help his people in the name of jesus christ